well, I think he does speak for uh, the vast majority of the British public. We want the UK to be a generous country, but th that generosity has limits. And if people say that they're destitute and want to rely on the British taxpayer to house them and support them, uh, they should accept the accommodation that's an offer. And whether that be the barge or the disused military sites we're bringing forwards, these will always be decent and legally compliant forms of accommodation, but they shouldn't be luxurious. We can't find ourselves in a position where illegal migrants uh, are able to pick and choose which four-star hotel they want to stay in uh, and in which part of the country. That's not right. Mm. That wouldn't be fair to the taxpayer, and that's not the approach we're going to take. And so if individuals don't move to uh, the barge, then we will consider removing their asylum support and they have to look after themselves. But I hope that they'll change their minds.